Welcome to Stacks Gaming. We got Sakazuki, blue and black. His no, effect is act the main once per turn. Uh, you may trash one card from your hand and draw one. And then when attacking, minus one cost to one of your opponent's characters. So basically a free smoker, plus you get to cycle. A lot better, definitely what we've been needing. Poor smoker. Yeah. Poor smoker. <laughs> but as your engine, definitely gotta go brand new. Mm -hmm. uh, basically, he helps fill up your graveyard to help extends for later games. Definitely need to start with him. Without that, you won't get too far. Then our regular 2Ks. You can rest this to uh, minus three to something, but the best one is the on play, yeah. okay. minus two, two K counter. Uh, a lot better, a lot more use. I knew he had the improvement. I saw then we have two. blocker. We only use them for two K. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's to have more two Ks yeah. in here. Very rarely do you play them down. Then the thing that makes you cycle your deck, the Rebecca. So on play, you can add up to one black character with a cost of three to seven. So it, it makes everything in the trash just come back to your hand. And if it's uh, three or less, you can just play it rested. And all the on play abilities start kicking in. Two, four Salinos, still viable. Two Sabos to protect board if you need to fix hand. And then the card that shot up out of nowhere which is the Hina from the structure deck on play minus four. So you use this with the Rebecca to constantly keep using her on play to minus four to something. So this is like your best body in the game on play. She didn't it, came out of the structure, right? Yeah. It was worth nothing and then shot up. Then our two ofs, because we can still get them back. Uh, four drop Kuzan. Uh, mainly for when attacking, they're gonna bottom him or try to get rid of him. But what you're trying to really get off are these raw blue cheese. Let's say MVP of black. Uh, you can on play return three cards from your graveyard, destroy a two cost or less and a one cost or less. So I think with the reduction of how much we can do in this deck, he's very viable. And then to get your graveyard full, rush Usa. With one dawn, when attacking, you can trash the top seven cards of your deck. So if you don't have anything in your graveyard you, you need to use, but you have another Rebecca, you play this down, put it down for five, you just fill it back up. Then we got the other new Borsalino seven. On play, return a four or less. Basically helps you extend and you can still get it back with uh, What's her name that just came out? What's in my one of? Great eruption minus two draw Then we got oh, Hound blaze Return a two or less to the bottom of the owner's deck boost something by 3,000 power non-restrictive and the best blue card that they've made that's super vague ice age back to main minus five have to get all those big bodies to get reduction uh, reduced because this deck has a hard time only removing one thing at once thousand swords so with these two together you can take out any ten costs Ideally, and still be able to put blockers down. This is the card that makes any card in your graveyard go back to your hand by placing two cards from your trash back to the bottom of your deck. So you're just cycling. You just recycle everything. And then the Uta is good in the mirror match. Ulti is good in the mirror match. It's also good for the Zoro and the Law matchups, just the bottom all their stuff. And then because you will be recycling the one coat. I was gonna play Sakazuki, but you can't bring him back and play him for free. You can do the Kobe for free. Interesting. So
This is basically the MVP. Oh, this one. I thought was doing such yep. Good. These two cards yeah, yeah, yeah. do all the yeah, recycling I in the I deck. I thought you actually. Okay. <coughs> Thank you. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what your thoughts are. Thank you.